My name is Seth Minkin. Thanks for coming by. I'm an artist, I'm a painter. You know, it's a little bit of a messy job at times, which definitely has a tendency to affect my dress code and, and, and what I wear because the, the paint does often fly. How would you actually describe your style? Casual, conservative. And what does that mean to you being conservative? How is that important? You know, conservative just because I don't really have any pieces that are, you know, really, really what I would consider to be wild or aggressive. Everything is pretty much centered around jeans. Um, and uh, I will either dress them up or, or dress them down. No matter what you do beyond that, no matter how much you dress it up, you're still in the casual zone with the jeans. And how does what you do day to day reflect your dress code or your style throughout the day? I think it's kind of a good exercise in being less materialistic because I can have a shirt on that I love, on comes the oil paint, and you know, it is what it is, so. And how does your style reflect on your personality? For the most part, I think a lot of where I inject personality into what I'm wearing is in the accessories. I love my Warby Parker glasses. I do need to see. Uh, so I figured out that if they're gonna be on your face 24 seven, they should be awesome and you should love them. I'm a big watch guy, I love, I love watches. What would the younger version of you think of Seth today? Oh, it'd be, he'd be so amazed. He'd be so impressed. Uh, now, honestly, I think I'd like it, you know, because I really did dress the same growing up. It was a very, I sort of always had a very conservative, neat sense of style and fashion. One word, a sentence, or that actually represent your dress code? Uh, open in, you know, open. I'm open to your suggestions.